Hello everyone, how are you? Welcome to my second video lesson. Hope you are doing well. I look forward to see you again at school. Okay, I hope you liked the first video. Uh, now, I think it helped you to work at home. Now, today we'll have another interesting topic. So, I mean video lesson again. Today's topic is about conjunctions. We'll go through this topic. So, key notes for today. Know what a conjunction is. Identify conjunctions in text. Use conjunctions in text. So, do you remember we covered all this topic in the classroom before? Now, what is a conjunction? Who remembers? I'm sure you already found the answer, some of you. Conjunctions are joining words. Yes? Good. Now, the answer is inside the question. Let's see. Conjunction. What junction means? Joining words. So, let me repeat myself. Conjunctions are joining words. Good. For example, and, but, or, so, because, after, before, while, when, etc. Now let's see the use of these conjunctions. And joins two similar ideas. Yeah? For example, bread and butter. Okay, can you find your own example? Right, or, or shows a choice between two or more options. For example, tea or coffee. Let's use it in the sentence. Would you like tea or coffee? So, but. But joins opposite ideas. For example, I like apples, but my friend likes bananas. So, so shows that the second idea is the result of the first one. For example, my granny is going to come to us today, so I need to go home early. Yeah? Because, because gives the reason and shows the result of what has happened. Let's give an example for this. I couldn't sleep well because there was so noise in the room. Yeah? So, because shows the result of what has happened. Now, let's do some activities to make sure you got all this so far. Now, we have an activity here. We'll read and underline conjunctions in this activity. She hates bananas, but she loves banana pie. Where is conjunction here? Read all these sentences and underline conjunctions. I give you some time to think about it and underline these conjunctions. Another sentence. We arrived at school and went into the classroom. Where is conjunction here? Okay, it's time to find. They were late for the show because there was a traffic jam. I was ill yesterday, so I didn't go to school. The torch will shine brightly as it has had new batteries. Now, if you are fine with finding conjunctions easily, let's move on to another activity. Now we'll have short test about conjunctions. Right, let's Circle the correct answer. I don't want to do my homework tonight. Mom says I have to. 
So you are going to find correct answer. One, I'm going to tell you, I don't, I do not want to do my homework tonight, but my mom says I have to. Yes. Let's move on to next next text. So in art class, I like to paint. Jane likes to draw. I'm going to music lessons. I can learn the piano. Dad said I can eat some strawberries. I can eat an apple. Do you want to go now? Should we go later? I want to go to jogging. I can stay healthy. My friend likes cheese. They do not like it on pizza. Would you like fizzy pop? Would you prefer fruit juice? Right. Now you're going to think about all these tests and you will find the correct answer and circle that answer. We'll check together. Now let's do some conjunction tests. First one. I was late for class this morning. The bus was late. Second, I usually go home at four o'clock. Then I watch TV for an hour. My classmate studies very hard. She always gets good grades. Thomas was really hungry this morning. He did not eat breakfast. We went to the airport. We forgot to bring our suitcases. Next one. Cassie decided to order spaghetti. Gary decided to order a pizza. And the last one. I was very sick yesterday. I didn't go to work. Now you have some time to find the answer of these tests. Then we'll check together. Let's move on to another activity. Now we have here a wheel that you will write on your own sentence using these conjunctions. For example, spin the wheel to choose a subordinating conjunction. On your whiteboard, write your own sentence about chocolate, including that conjunction to start a subordinate clause. So you will write a sentence using all these conjunctions or some of them. I think you're already thinking that, oh, Ms. Shahla gave so many activities. Now let's start to play game. Okay, now we'll play who wants to be a millionaire. I'm sure you like this game. Let's start. Right, now we have some questions here. I will ask these questions and I will show you and you will find at home. Who gets true answers more? Please write it down. When we go to school again, you will tell me and I'll give you some presents. Right? Let's start. So, which conjunction would you use? Question one. I'm thirsty. Hungry. We have four options here. One of them is correct. Or, so, and, but. Which one is correct answer? You have 30 seconds to think about it. Second question. Which conjunction would you use? We can walk to school, take a bus. Again, we have four answers here. So, as, and, or. Next question. Which conjunction would you use? I will study every night. 
I can pass the test. The answers are here. So, as, but, or. Which one's correct answer? Remember, you have 30 seconds for each question. Another question. The waiter was not very nice. The food was delicious. And, but, as, so. And the last question. Joel did not have enough money for a burger. A drink. And, but, so, or. Now that's the end of this game. If you have any questions, again, you go you can go back to the starting of the video lesson, check again and try to remind all the rules about conjunctions and do this activity. So, this is the end of this revision lesson. I hope I could be helpful to you. Let's keep in touch and overcome all these difficulties. Please feel free to contact with me anytime on portal. Write if you have any questions, any concerns or any mistakes. If you want me to explain anything to you, write to me and don't worry, I will explain all single details to you. Okay. See you next video lesson. Love you all. Bye-bye.